After someone comes out as transgender, both them and their family often contact me and ask me, will this transition change their personality? And I always answer that with no. Your personality is what it is. Uh, for me, I'm seven years into my transition and my personality is exactly the same as it was before I transitioned. My laugh is the same, my sense of humor is the same, uh, some of the goofy things that I do, my clumsiness, all those things haven't changed, all right? Your insides don't change from a transition. It's just your physical appearance begins to match who you are uh, inside yourself. Another thing that people ask me is, well, hormones, especially for trans men, well, hormones make me angry, all right? There's this view that you're gonna have like all this roid rage or turn into the Hulk and get all green or all muscly or something from hormones. And the reality is, uh, from everybody that I've known, and I know hundreds of people that have gone through this transition process, I have not seen any of them express roid rage, all right? In fact, some people that I knew that were angry before their transition are actually pretty even keel now. So, you know, your mood may change a little bit here and there, but I don't see you ever turning into a big green hulk. Uh, another thing that people like to ask me is, what are the long-term effects of being on hormones? Is this gonna cause cancer? Is, is my child gonna die young from being on hormones? And I like to say to them, you know, unfortunately, we don't have long-term studies on hormone use. However, people that I know have been transitioning 15, 20, 30 years, are still living strong and doing really well. All right. Uh, the important thing to remember is when you get on hormones, listen to your doctor. All right. Uh, when you get on hormones, go to those appointments. Have the lab work drawn. If they ask you to change something in your diet or your lifestyle, try to do that. Try to integrate more healthy habits into your life to help you to live longer on hormones and be happy. You know, I always say to families, even though there's not long-term studies out there on hormones, I would rather live five years being who I am than live an entire life denying who I am because of the fear of uh, a negative health effect. It's worth it just to be me. Uh, if you do these things, you're gonna have a happy and healthy transition with hormones.